what's up guys welcome back to my channel in this video i'm gonna show you how to fix eden emulator stuck on launching screen with black screen you can see black screen and zero fps you can see it's not responding so let's fix it close your emulation stop it solution number one right click go to remove and remove all pipeline catches click on yes and okay now start the game solution number two right click and go to remove and remove install update solution number three right click remove remove all install dlc okay and right click again and remove and remove catches storage now play the game solution number four if you are using eden emulator version 0.0.3 .0 or 0.0.4 officially released then you need eden nightly this one you can see eden nightly so you can use it nightly so you need to update your emulator if you have uh, this version of eden or if you have eden nightly version so you need to update eden emulator to run new games in your eden emulator solution number five open your eden emulator and for more settings and solution go to emulation configuration and go to graphics tab but go to system first and use memory layout by default do not use 8 gb or 6 gb unsafe okay use this one by default check this option here and use 100 percent go to cpu and you can use this one otherwise you can uh, uncheck this option here now go to graphics tab and select Vulcan and okay now play the game and if you're still facing the issue then you need to change your backend here and select OpenGL and select this one okay and start the game some games are workable with OpenGL some games workable with Vulkan okay this backend API so you can try these options one by one but I I recommend Vulkan for the game for this game in your Eden emulator so use Vulkan instead of OpenGL and select this one Vsync on and select 1x resolution here do not use uh, 2x or 3x because I have a simple GPU so i will choose this one and select super resolution fx double a and go to advanced tab select normal from here do not choose extreme or high and select bc3 medium quality and uncheck this option and here go to extension and uh, choose this one here three uh take it to back to zero okay here zero it's very important thing and okay solution number six if you're still facing the issue then go to emulation configuration and go to control choose handheld mod okay and try again solution number seven go to emulation configuration select from here dock mod and try again solution number eight right click on it and go to open save data location select your username okay and delete your save file hit delete and try again and make sure we have successfully deleted the shaders before starting the game 
remove all pipe and catches. Solution number nine. You need to update your game. Go to file, install files to NAND, and you need to update your game. This is my game uh, update file. Open, install. Now my game is up to date, okay? This one. After updating your game, uh, some updates needs uh, updated keys to run in the emulator of the game. Then you need to update the prod.keys code file, open it in folder NAND and roaming Eden keys folder. Delete this key and open this folder, copy this one and paste here. Now restart the emulator and start the game. Solution number 10. Some updates can cause a crashing issue. Uh, so you need to remove your update file. Right click on it and uh, go to remove, remove install update. You can see uh, the update has been removed. Now right click and uh, go to remove catchy, all pipeline catches, and play the game. Solution number 10, go to emulation configuration and go to graphics tab and select your more powerful GPU if you have multiple GPUs. Okay, and right click on your computer screen and go to display settings here and scroll down go to graphic settings here check this option and go to browse go to desktop go to your uh, Eden emulator notly open file locations like this one add and this is my emulator options high performance and save now close it and uh, restart the emulator and try again Solution number 11 Mod data location and delete all mods files from the game. Hit delete and try again without the mods. Solution number 12 Go to search bar on your Windows, type here device manager. Go to device manager control panel and go to display adapter here and right click on your GPU device and properties and drivers so you can check your driver date and driver version and uh, you need to update drivers for your gpu if you have already updated version of drivers then you can use rollback driver otherwise you can use clean installation the drivers for your gpu so these are my new drivers right click and run as administrator now check this option and activate and continue and custom advanced next check this option perform a clean installation and click on next solution number 13 guys you can see i'm using file type nsp you can see these are my game in nsp type okay so if you are using nsp then you need xci file you can convert nsp file to XA file so you can try XA file if you have NSP file and if you have already using XEI file then use NSP file okay so you can try one by one NSP file and XA file solution number 14 you need to update your firmware files go to tools install firmware from zip because my file is in zip folder so go to desktop and this one select this one open now play the game remove all pipeline catches and try again whenever you try to play the game you need to remove all remove all pipeline catches and play the game and enjoy please subscribe to the channel like the video